It was a great tournament. It was a good showing. So I think a lot of people in Taiwan were were hungry for some competition, and there hadn't been any big events. They've been cancelled the last two years. So some people who had actually registered two years for this tournament were automatically re-registered uh, for this one this year. So. got disqualified for for can opener oh really? <laughs> so funny he's never done it before like he never thought to do it someone did it to him in training a week ago and he's like oh that was a good move <laughs> that worked He wasn't training much. Uh -huh. His cardio was zapped. Yeah. And he was looking pretty good. He got a crazy back take. I don't know what you call this back take, but it's like from north south, mm -hmm. you're on the bottom. Mm -hmm. I do this all the time. say all the cliche things but most of them are really true right like if you do lose a match it's a good opportunity to find out where your mistakes are right if you're able to get the footage from your matches then you can kind of break down and be like oh right here I should have did this and then having like an open mat time or a drill time at your gym is perfect for you to address those problems that may come up we got we got rich the red the red tiger rich from coming up second match First match won by a nice triangle. Look for the armbar option, finish the triangle. He's been training at the, at the den a little over a year. Some Muay Thai, some MMA, some BJJ. So I'm looking forward to him making a, his presence felt in his first competition today. He's got his second match up next. Okay, here we go over here, we got Rich. Let's go now, Rich. The Red Tiger. Red Tiger, Rich the Red Tiger, yeah, 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 he's good, he's awesome, he's very dedicated, he's a student of the art, he studies it, he asks lots of questions, which is really good, and he loves it, he is a Tai Chi master as well, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> had Tai Chi and everything, right? Just as expected, the Red Tiger finished his second match. You know, oh, hello oh, Professor, nice to see you. Nice to see you. <laughs> yeah. So we had the, the Red Tiger finish his second match by triangle, that's two for the day. Right, had a nice body lock take down to start, get his two. Moved over to mount, didn't get his points for the mount. I think the ref was sleeping a little bit there, but that's okay. Points aren't necessary when you're always going for the kill. Another thing I'll tell students is that um, 
everybody's gonna lose at some point. So yeah. the good thing about jujitsu is you're gonna learn how to accept loss. Because there's gonna be lots of guys out there who can't win everything, right? So sometimes you you lose many times and then it teaches you like, ah, this is normal, it can happen, right? As long as you're not injured, that's the biggest thing, right? Walking away from a tournament, um, being unscathed from injuries is like, a, a, the greatest thing. <laughs> Whether you win a medal or not, medals are nice, yeah, but injuries are the worst. So. Shake the ref's hand. Uh, in total, I just like stuck in food and foot out. Now we're gonna, now if you need to work on something, how to finish from the back. Finishing from the back is very important. Every time we get to the back, we need to be finishing from the back. Nobody should ever be escaping the back. Yeah, you went to the body time a little bit too late. So if you feel you get body time and you start to turn, you open it back up. You gotta stay chest to back. When they're trying to turn, you gotta stay really tight. And hug them, hug them, hug them, everything else looks good. Okay, get some water. And then give yourself a little massage. That's how you feel. Forearms good? Yeah, I feel warm. Okay, good. I feel warm. Good, good. Yeah. Okay, so. don't go too far because we're gonna call your name. Probably got yes, some matches. All right, good stuff. We had. Uh, Five competitors compete. We came away with 13 medals, oh, nice. eight golds, which was pretty good. A couple absolutes, and yeah, the guys are training hard. Everyone, they're all like fairly new to jujitsu and stuff, but they they found that passion all within like the first year of training. I don't think about it too much I, when I compete I don't worry about it actually at all and if it happens it happens but um, I always tell my students hey you lost look your body's fine you can get back it on the mats in a couple days or whenever you feel ready sometimes the next day, sometimes the next day. Sometimes yeah we got lot, we got lots of yeah. people they'll be the next day right yeah. but I will say look if you're a little sore your muscles sore because you we train really hard w leading up to the matches I any of my guys who are on the competition team, they must do the air bike. They must track their weight. I put it all up on the whiteboard and stuff like that. I think this gives them encouragement from their other teammates and also the confidence that their cardio is gonna be good. So I push them really hard in the cardio. You know, sometimes as a coach, this is the tough thing. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna assign you to be a coach. Get over there right now and go and coach Ivan the Wonderful. Chen Dai first, seat belt first, seat belt, back left now. hand behind Go. her head, Good. Le right hand behind her head, yes. Good, now let's get Kimura grip please. Kimura grip on the inside. Good, okay, beautiful, you're on the back, you got your points. Nice work. Bring your left hand out and get on there the There you mat. go. Shake, shake, shake. You're good here, you're good here. Arm bar oh, off. Oh, Angle was your Yeah, there's the choke. Nice. Good job. Nice match ladies, nice work. Very good job. Nice fight. Had to get in. She was defending well. That was good. You girls had a good match. Super nice. Good. Got a little warm up. Yeah. Good. Good. And how was that in? That's it. Absolute. Absolute. Come on, taking it down. something I don't quite know what to make of this but my, my Tai Chi teacher told me this my bipolar Tai Chi teacher <laughs> he told me and I think about this a lot he says invest in loss uh -huh. and that's uh -huh. a real hard thing for us to, to, to go to as competitive men yeah like going in to tournament and it's tricky man because you don't want to go in there and just lose like that doesn't feel good that, that you're not gonna learn anything but it's like try your best 
and accept the loss. Send closer! Okay, let go! That's him, my man, like Puyoti! Puyoti, wait! You can't have those in my waffles, okay? I think it's absolutely true and it's prevalent in jujitsu the longer you do it you're gonna lose so sometimes I, I remember you know you take flights you go to Thailand you have hotels you pay for um, tournament fees you pay for plane tickets, everything you pay for, it can get expensive yeah. and stuff, right? So I have the mentality to win, but I've had losses and I've been like, ah, you know, that's okay though. Mm -hmm. It's, it's going to happen. Let's go back and see where I went wrong. And, and if you lose multiple times, you get more comfortable with that. Yeah. So you, you invest in emotionally. If you lose, I, I think it's a good game plan. Good to have, to have that mindset. Okay. I've had moments of like real confidence yeah. and it's, it's very fleeting and I can't rely on it. Okay. Yeah. So it's, it's, for me, it's, it's show up and see what happens. Okay. okay. Yeah. Get there, hydrated, on yeah. weight. Yeah. You know, do the bare minimum, be a professional. Yeah. My outfit's gonna look good, my hair's cut. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I agree. I agree. And what happens after that's not up to me. It's, okay. like, it's like entering a storm or something mm -hmm. where it's like, you know, we're, we're going into warfare. Let's go, baby, let's go. The first one don't matter, this one matters. You can tap him from here, Rich. Drive that left shoulder pressure. Head and arm, head and arm, head and arm, Joe. Triangle, Rich, triangle. He's going for the foot. Yes, good. Put your weight on that foot now, stand on it. Good job, Rich, good job. And so things are gonna happen. You know, you think your match is at this time. It's not at that time. It's never on time. Or something like that could throw me off. I should come in there with an excuse. Yeah. And investing in loss is like, no excuses, just do your best. It doesn't matter. Mm -hmm. And uh, through that mindset, I, I, I won. Yeah, good yeah. for you, good for you. Good match, good match. We don't have to do it, we don't have to do it. Good fight guys, good fight.